Hey guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Krypton. In today's video, we're going to take a look at the best nade spots on the map Moscow on Black Ops Cold War. Within this video, there's a total of 11 nade spots. Starting off on the attacking side, we have 6 spots total. All these spots cover the whole span of the middle of the map. Moving on to the defending side, we have a total of 3 spots. These spots mainly cover mid and the B side of the map. And then also have 2 spots that covers B flag and A flag from B. I have now changed this series up a little bit, I'll be focusing on the main nade spots for game modes and I have removed noob tube spots because noob tubes don't really work on core, they're really good in hardcore. If you guys would like any noob tube spots for hardcore or even core at that, I would definitely recommend going checking out SF Rebellion, he covers every spot known under the sun on every map, his link will be down in the description if you want to go check him out, definitely head over there, he'll show you every spot you need to know. The next map in the series is going to be Raid. You guys can vote for the next map after that down in the comment section down below. If you're going to enjoy this video, please drop a like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you get notified when I upload. I also stream over on Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash Krypton on air. But yeah, drop a comment down below what you think of season 1 so far. And let's get straight into it. Alright guys, starting off on the attacking side, you're going to want to come over to this area right here. Pop up on this fountain, stand right here, aim up. See this wire right here, you want to aim for it. Hold your nade, throw it, and it'll bank off that back wall at anybody that's standing on A, coming through the double doors, trying to run mid. For the second spot, you're going to want to hop down from the first one, to come to this area right here. You're going to want to aim and line with the middle of that balcony, sort of. The first balcony right there. You're going to aim and throw your nade and jump. It's going to launch your nade over to where they like to sit in the back corner to snipe you as you run through the A. For the third spot, you're going to be wanting to run down to mid. You're going to come to these double doors, aim up, in between them two windows and throw your nade. It's going to bank off and kill anybody that sits in the head glitch there, sniping or using an AR, which allows you to run through the map. For the fourth spot in the attacking side, you're going to want to come to the right, off spawn, over to B. Stand just the other side of this bus, aim up, and line with the edge of that building. Sort of just above that light as you can see my cross here. Hold your nade and throw it. It's going to kill anybody run down that alleyway beside the bus station. Allowing you to rush through the outskirts to get to B. For the fifth spot we're back over by A. This is if someone in your team calls out that there's somebody over by B and mid by the globe. You're going to want to stand in this area right here. Aim up just sort of in the middle of that wall there. Aim up. You're going to want to launch your nade over and jump. It's going to bank off the building and kill anybody standing by the head glitch and mid, sort of looking down to our spawn. For the sixth and final spot in the attack inside, this is mainly if your teammate calls out that there's a guy trying to rush mid or they rush mid often on a search and destroy. This is also useful on domination because people love the rush mid all the time to try and get the B flag if you have it. Do you want to Gonna want to come down to this tile right here, aim up and throw your nade just over this building. It's gonna go through the glass and kill anybody going down the stairs, trying to hit B on mud or just in search and destroy trying to rush your spawn. Yeah. Alright guys, moving on to the defending side of the map. These first two spots are pretty easy to hit. They're just really handy to use once you're trying to rush through mud. So you're going to want to walk up to this head glitch right here. Aim your crosshair sort of in line with the bottom of that wall. And then throw your nade over. It's going to kill anybody that likes to stand on the head glitch in mud sort of. It's trying to snipe you. Once again, just come to the left side on these stairs. Just aim right above this so your nade just lips over. Throw it over and it's going to kill anybody that's near the head glitch at the back. This is more for somebody that's rushing through in the mud. This clears it and allows you to run to their spawn. Once again, make sure to check up to the right just in case somebody's aiming down for me. For the third spot in the defending side, you're going to want to come right beside B on the outskirts. Run up this pole right here, aim up. Sort of just above the number on the big billboard, you're going to want to aim over. Hold your nade and jump. It's going to kill anybody that is standing on the head glitch at the back side, sort of trying to snipe you as you run through the outskirts. Yeah. 
All right, guys, so now I have two really good spots to get utilized in domination. These will both cover B flag and A flag. All right, guys, so for this first spot, you're gonna wanna line up with this pillar right here. Sort of aim up with this yellow thing right here on this building. Aim out a little bit and throw your nade. Once I get it. Throwing lethal. It's gonna land on B and kill anybody trying to cap the flag. This final spot in domination is going to kill anybody that's head glitching on the far right side of A, sort of head glitching looking in the mid. Come down to this area right here, aim up through this little gap right here, and launch it over. It's going to kill anybody that's head glitching on the back side of A, sort of at that pillar as you'll see in the skill cap. Alright guys, that is going to do it for all the spots on Moscow. I am planning to have more domination spots and other game mode spots on other maps. It's just because this map is well built up. So it isn't easy to have an easy nade on this map. But I want to try and make it as easy as possible for you guys. So if you did go and enjoy the video, please drop a like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you get notified of upload. Once again, Raid will be the next map. So you can vote for the next map after that down in the comment section down below. I will try and get these videos out as quick as possible to you guys. But yeah, stay motivated, never give up, have an awesome day. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.